I don't want to forget anything. Remember to pack my sunglasses and my sandals and my favorite blue towel. Oh, and my pail. That's and... enough. Come on, let's go. All right, all right. I'm ready. To the beach. To the beach. I think I need my sandals now. Why? To walk on the sand. That's why they're called sandals, you know. There you go. Don't they look nice? Yes. Let's go. Come on, bees. I'm going in! Don't forget to put on some sunblock! I don't like that stuff. It smells funny. But you should still put it on. I will. After I swim, okay? Okay, but don't forget. Whee! Come on in! The water's lovely! Oh! It's freezing! <laughs> Ooh, brr! I like your seahorse. Thank you. So do I. <laughs> I don't need one of those things. I'm naturally buoyant. That means floaty. Are you sure it feels warm after you get used to it? Hooray! Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> Watch it! Look where you're going! That's hard enough! Uh, sorry! Remember your sunblock, Beast. I will, I will. Who wants to play catch? I do. Hey! <laughs> Come on, Hamilton. Come and play catch. All right, but don't throw it at my head. Pigs are very sensitive, you know. Over here, over here. I got it. <laughs> <laughs> <Catch>. <laughs> Thanks for the dance! Ah. Remember your sunblock, Beast. <sighs> oh, I will. Mm. <sighs> oh. <laughs> Did you see that? I feel a little warmish. Ah, that's better. I think. 
think it's time to go home, Hamilton. Beast? Where's the beast? <sighs> He's probably swimming again. I'll go look for him. Beast? Beast? Time to go home! Maggie! Maggie! Hamilton! Help! Help! Oh, there, there's a big red sea monster in the water! A sea monster? A sea monster? Great googly moogly! Ah! Oh, I know I'm a ferocious beast, but you don't have to be scared of me, Hamilton. Why are you looking at me like that? You didn't put on your sunblock, did you, beast? Um, no, I didn't. Come with me. Take a look. Ah! It's the sea monster! No, it's not. It's you. Oh! I'm all red! I don't want to be all red! Ow! Poor bees, you've got sunburn. And it hurts. What should we do? Baby powder might help. Good idea. Hold still, bees. And close your eyes. <laughs> oh, bees, you're backwards. I am? Now you're red with yellow spots. I look just like my cousin, Reggie Van Beast. Ow, that hurts. Ooh, look at the sunset. Oh. It's beautiful. Except for my sunburn, this was a very good day at the beach. Can we come back tomorrow? Only if you promise to. Put, put on, on your, your sunblock. sunblock. Okay, I will. <laughs> Say cheese. Hi, Maggie. Hi, Bees. Hi, Hamilton. Maggie, what's that in your hand? I found this photograph of you and me, and I put it in this frame. It's for you. Oh, thank you. I'll keep it forever. Look, Hamilton. Hmm, nice picture. I'm so glad Maggie found this. It's a great picture of the two of us. Hmm. Where would you like to go today? Gee, what's this place with these funny-looking horses? Those aren't horses. Those are llamas. I think maybe that's where we should go. What do you think, Hamilton? I guess. Is something wrong? <sighs> no. <sighs> Thank you again for the picture. I'll keep it forever. Yes. It is a great picture. I'm glad I found it. Hamilton, are you ready for Llama Land? You and the Beast have a good time. I think I'll stay here. Hamilton, what's wrong? Nothing. I just don't feel like traveling today. But it won't be any fun without you. <sighs> You'll have a good time. Beast, why don't you let Hamilton put your picture in his box where it'll be safe? Okay. Please, Hamilton. Thank you. What is wrong with Hamilton? I don't know. He seems so sad. Why don't you take a walk? If I'm alone with him, perhaps he'll tell me. Okay, if you think so. I think I'll go for a little stroll. Hamilton, tell me why you're
you're sad. Uh, I'm not sad. Yes, you are. Now tell me. Maggie, I went for a stroll. May I come back now? Not yet, bees! Hamilton, I know there's something wrong. It's nothing, really. I just thought I'd stay here and... <sighs> Maggie! I went around twice! Go around once more, bees! Oh, all right. <laughs> Bees, stop stamping your feet. You're making us seasick. All right, but I'm getting tired. Dear <sighs> Hamilton, please tell me what's troubling you. I know the beast has beautiful polka dots, and he's soft and cuddly, and you can ride on his back. Bees, I don't understand. Well, <sighs> sometimes... I feel sad because I know you love the beast more than you love me. But that's not true, dear Hamilton. I understand. Really, I do. Oh, I'm not soft and cuddly. And I don't say funny things like great googly moogly. Oh, dear sweet Hamilton. I love you just as much as I love the beast. He's soft and cuddly. But you're made of lovely pink velvet. It is rather nice, isn't it? But what about my big nose? It's a perfect nose for a handsome little pig. <laughs> Do you really think so? Without a doubt. Um, oh, oh, never mind. What? Uh, no, no, it isn't important. Hamilton, what is it? Well, it's just that you gave that nice picture to the beast, and and I don't have a picture of just you and me. Don't you remember? You took that picture of me and the beast when you got your new camera. You're right. I remember now, and, and I didn't want the beast to touch my camera. So he couldn't take our picture. That's right. Maggie, I'm getting tired. Come on back, beast. I'm back. You feeling better, Hamilton? Yes. Maggie and I had a nice talk. I have an idea. Get your camera, and we'll have the beast take a picture of you and me. Oh, that's a great idea. And, and will you put it in a frame like the beasts? Of course. Oh, this is so great. My very own picture with Maggie, and I'm getting a frame just like beasts. Right, Maggie? Right. Okay, Beast, you stand here. When we're ready, you press the button. This button? That's right, but not until we're ready. Oh. Let's see. That's perfect. Now I'm going back to pose with Maggie. When I say ready, you push the button, Beast. Have you got that? Yes, Hamilton, of course. Great googly moogly. All right, all right. Okay, okay. I just want a good picture. Okay, Beast, get ready. I'm ready, I'm ready. No, stop. Not yet. How's this smile, Maggie? That's fine, Hamilton. Now let's take the picture. We're ready, Beast. Press the button. Say cheese. Cheese! Oh, here it comes! Ooh, 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 look! Oh, it's perfect! I really took a good picture, didn't I? You are an outstanding photographer, Beast. I'll put this in my box where it'll be safe. You will bring me a frame for it, just like Beast? I promise. Now let's get started. And Hamilton, bring your camera. We can take some pictures of the llamas. Could we please get going? I'll get my box. We're off 
to see the llamas. Hooray! Sailing away. Hi, Maggie. Farther. Closer. What's that, Maggie? It's a telescope. Look through it. Wow! It makes things look closer. Beast, look through this at me. How'd you get so far away? Hamilton, come back! From where? You've got it the wrong way around. Try it like this. Great googly moogly! Not so close, Hamilton. <laughs> Telescopes are used for looking at things that are far away. When I want to see something far away, I just walk closer and I can see it just fine. <laughs> hey, not so close! Sea captains use this to look for islands out on the ocean. And that's what we're going to do, too. Look for islands? Uh, out on the ocean? See there? There's a place called Secret Island that's right off the edge of this map. We can go and discover it. Why is it a secret? It's a secret because nobody knows where it is. <gasps> but we could get lost. Yeah, it'll be a thrilling adventure. That sounds good to me. Let's go. But we don't have a boat. <laughs> Follow me. Oh. Wee! It's beautiful. And you made it all by yourself, Maggie? Yep. All I had to do was think big. Now, help me put it in the water. All aboard! Ooh. Bon voyage! Come on, Hamilton. There's nothing to be afraid of. The weather's fine, and we've got our life jackets on. I suppose. <gasps> and we're on our way! Well, this isn't so bad. That's the spirit, Hamilton. We're courageous sea explorers. Avast, mateys! Secure the jib! Batten down the hatches! Shiver me timbers! <laughs> Goodness, Hamilton. What does all that mean? <laughs> I'm not sure, but it's what you're supposed to say on boats. Ah. Oh. Maggie is the captain, because she has the map and the telescope. And you two are my loyal crew. Aye, aye, Captain. Captain. We'll take turns looking for the island, and the first person to see it gets to shout, Land ho! Land ho! Let's go to the front of the boat and see if we can see it. The front of the boat is called the bow, Hamilton. Does that mean we have to bow when we get there? I guess so. No, no island yet. Whoa! Hey, this isn't the front, I mean the bow anymore. To the bow! To the to bow! The bow! <laughs> <laughs> nope, nothing yet. Whoa! I hope we find that island soon. I'm starting to get seasick. Squawk! Hello? Squawk! Hello! Are you a fishing boat? No, we're a secret island finding boat. Oh, too bad. Do you know where Secret Island is? 
Yes, I do. Where is it? Can't tell. Why not? Because it's called Secret Island. And if I told you where it was, it wouldn't be a secret anymore. Hmm, I suppose not. But I can tell you. You're getting warm, very warm. Quack! Quack! She means we're getting close, very close. To the bow! To the bow! Hmm. I do see something that might be an island, but it's very, very far away. Peace. It goes this way. Ooh. Land ho! Land ho! Land ho! There! Now we can explore the island! Come on, crew! Follow me! Aye, aye, aye Captain! Captain. We're right back where we started. Great googly moogly. This is a very small island. And it's very hot, too. Is anyone thirsty? Yes. yes. Why, thank you, Beast. <sighs> it's a nice little island. I like it. <sighs> I can't wait to get back and tell everyone about it. Beast, what about the secret? What secret? It's called Secret Island. We shouldn't tell anyone about it. Ah. We could keep it as our special secret. What do you say, Beast? A special secret? Just between the three of us? Ah. So I can't tell Nedley? No. Or the Moo sisters? No. How about... No! Oh. Okay. 